Welcome everybody. Thank you. Thank you for joining us today. We'll talk about uh, how and why to upgrade to Oracle Database 19C. So uh, first of all, uh, John will present the technical stuff today. Uh, John is our uh, lead DBA and handles everything to do with Oracle administration in our AWS cloud uh, and for our customers. Uh, I'm the founder of Skill Builders, Dave Anderson, and uh, one of Oracle DBA skills myself. So John and I will co-present here. What we're going to present to you is first why you should upgrade, and then how to upgrade. In the why portion, uh, we'll first start with the different levels of Oracle support uh, so that you uh, have an understanding of what Oracle provides for your uh, support fees and um, what the current support levels are for the various database releases. And I think you'll quickly see that there is not only financial, but compliance matters uh, that will encourage you to upgrade to 19C fairly quickly. And that's why uh, John will take the wheel and uh, um, talk to us about how to upgrade. So we'll go through some various steps, kick off a uh, upgrade itself, talk about a little bit about some of the huge new features, just a, just a couple of mentions of the big new features. Again, on the obsolete and deprecated features, just a quick mention of things we're losing. Um, obviously, we're in the world of multi-tenant database, Oracle database now. So John will give us some considerations for converting to multi-tenant while you're upgrading. Some pros and cons there. We have a, a couple of free tutorials on the website about multi-tenant database if you haven't yet studied that. And a couple of other pearls of wisdom about 19C. Um, yes, we'll uh, put a copy of the slides on the uh, uh, webinar page that you use to learn more about this webinar. Uh, yes, you'll get the slides. We're also recording it and we'll post this shortly. Please do continue to put your questions in the uh, questions box. And uh, if John uh, or I can get to them while we're talking, we will. But we'll take two opportunities today to answer your questions. One, as we tr transition from why to upgrade to how to upgrade, so sort of a little bit in the middle here. And then again, we'll save 10 minutes at the end of, your presenta of this presentation for answering questions. So please don't hesitate. 